Hey everybody, I know everything's a little weird right now in the world and uh, I'm just going to start off this video hoping that everyone's safe and sound out there right now. What I want to talk to you guys about was something that got kind of accelerated because of all the recent events was uh, my home gym and my shed. I decided that I wanted to make something for myself that I could come and work out in and for right now I'm not going to the gym because of everything that's going on with this virus. Uh, that being said, a lot of the gyms still are open, which I don't really understand why they're open, but I decided that I, I'm not gonna go, not really to protect myself, but to protect the people around me. I don't wanna get anyone sick, I don't want that on my shoulder, so. So what that did was it kinda accelerated me to build my shed into something I could work out in. And you guys wanted to see it when I did it, when I posted that one video, because you guys are pretty interested in this kind of stuff, so I decided I'd show you guys what I got going on the shed. It's not a lot, it's not a lot going on here. Hey man, it's something. All right, pretty basic shed. Uh, yesterday, this is what I had before yesterday. I had a bands, one of these bands, uh, some push-up bars, dip bars, a jump rope that I never unpackaged yet. I had a pull-up bar inside, but I decided that I was not going to use the pull-up bar inside and hang it on one of those door frames because it damaged the door frames a lot. So I went in this shed and I was like, dang, I don't even need to install a pull-up bar. If you look where I have that shirt hang up. Right there, I do pull-ups on this thing right like that. I went out and got myself a barbell. As you guys know, I used to do only body weight, and I used to do a ton of body weight. I loved it. I was super into the body weight for a little bit. Recently, I started working in weights again. Uh, I'm trying to get a little bit bigger. It's really hard. Uh, I'm struggling with it, but I'm slowly trying to get bigger, up the calories, start lifting a little bit heavier. But uh, you know, this is this is one of those scenarios where you know it's going to make it a little more difficult now to do it, but. I decided instead of just doing only the body weight stuff that I wanted to still continue with the weights at home because I like lifting weights and stuff like that. So I found a guy that was local to us that sells used gym equipment that he gets from like old, uh, I guess, gyms that closed down or something like that. So I was watching um, someone on Instagram the other day and they said one of the best investments you can get is a barbell and some plates because they will last forever and they'll be with you forever and you can use them with so many different exercises. So that's exactly what I did. They didn't have any 45s. Damn door just keeps closing. Come on now, stay open. So I had to get the next heaviest plate I could find, which is 35. So I got four 35s right here. And then for like, just like flies and stuff like that, lighter weight shoulder movements, like front raises and stuff like that, side ladder raises. I found these weights. They're the only matching ones that they had so that my arm, one arm wouldn't get bigger than the other quite possibly. They're wielder, wider, they're wider, international, 11 pound weights. Never in my life have I ever seen an 11 pound weight anywhere and when I saw them I was like hmm they didn't have any 10s left and they didn't have any 15s left and I was like I guess 11s will work. Another thing I made was this very very sketchy dip bar. I decided to drill a bunch of 2x4s together in a very sketchy way. I just gave myself a splinter. As you can tell this is going to be a high splinter area right here. Oh, ho, 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 squirrels in my backyard, having a little party, come on now. Go this way guys, we're gonna go get a little, uh, little workout in if you guys are trying to you know, hit a couple sets. This is like inception right now, it's like the next day, but then we're gonna go back to the previous day. But I'm gonna do a little workout right now. You're probably wondering why I'm in a long sleeve shirt. Start out in this, get the body temperature through the roof, skyrocketed, freaking making me all hot and bothered. And then when I get too bothered, I take this off. And then underneath that, I got a tank top. No better than a Dwight Schrute office tank top. If you don't like the office, uh, well then, I'm not gonna say I don't like you, but like I, 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 I wouldn't hang out with you. This thing right here, when it sits in the sun, becomes like a sauna. I've never sweat so much in my entire life. Any gym I've ever gone to, they got the AC on, and it's hard to work up that sweat, but dude, in here I was, I was cooked, hour in, by the end of the hour and a half workout, I was fried. Pretty stoked on that, but just stay safe out there right now. Uh, you know, it's really weird. I've never seen this in all 22 years I've been on this planet Earth. I've never seen something like this in my entire life. And uh, so it's definitely a little bit weird. It's a little bit foreign to me. And uh, I know you guys are probably all saying the same thing. So all I gotta say is, we're all in this together. We're gonna get through this. And uh, just be safe out there, all right? 